So today we're going to look at another food preservation technique that you can easily do at home. My husband built this for me. It's a solar dryer and I dry fruit and vegetables in it. So yesterday uh, I went out and went strawberry picking and I managed to pick about 10 pounds of strawberries and I put cut them up and put them up here to dry. Sorry. Cut them in half, and they're all up here drying right now. This is about half the load. Five pounds of strawberries. to just take a couple days. So you can see there's a wire mesh screen here at the bottom. This stick here will move over and hold the top up. Like that. And the top is also a wire mesh screen. We tried using a lighter uh, black plastic mesh, but the squirrels and chipmunks can chew right through that, so we went back to the metal mesh. And here I'll do a close-up for you so you can see that. Metal mesh. I've seen people make these before very quickly and easily from screen doors, putting one screen door on top, one on the bottom, and hinging the sides together. This is how my husband chose to do it. It folds flat, so the legs are on the side fold underneath and the ones on the right fold underneath and then the top comes down and latches with a window latch. This is stored easily in a shed for the winter time and again it doesn't have to be hot in order to dehydrate fruits or vegetables it just needs to be sunny so we get a good airflow from the bottom and airflow from the top. So I love this thing I use it all the time I just um, recently dried a whole bunch of garlic that I had left over from last season that was still good. Now I'm doing strawberries, I'll do zucchini, I'll do hot peppers, jalapenos, serrano, whatever I feel like. Um, do a lot of dried onions this way and it doesn't cost anything but the few dollars it takes to make the setup. So let me know if you have any questions. Um, when the strawberries are done I'll do a quick little video to show you how they're coming along. This, oh, let's see, I just started this yesterday, and they're still pretty soft. Yeah, they're sticking a little bit right now, but when they're all dry, they'll peel right off of this really easily. So, there you go. There you have it. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. Bye.